This is Hydrogen Tap 1 Series 3L. I received a lot of email about where I am and why things aren't moving faster. The 3L is the reason. I've been working on this in the lab and wasn't going to publish it until I was finished, which is about one and a half days from now. But due to the email, I've decided to show you what's going on. This is the 3L. As you can see, there's been quite a few changes. This has two water sensors in it, a fill sensor on the top and a, and a sensor on the low level. The 3L series, I'm going to have pictures of it on my website, hydrogentap.com, for any of you who are interested. It's hydrogentap, T-A-P. As you can see, I've added the two electrodes on the top. This is a picture of the plate system with the electrodes that are gold plate. Also, I mounted the electrodes on a stand, which you can see on the left side, and there's one on the right side, along with a screw that goes all the way through. That's on the right side, and there's also one that comes through on the left. This holds the plates in the center of the unit so they don't move. Also, it keeps it off the bottom. The 3L series has a lot of new revisions. Most of it is on the top, as you can see, the plastic that I've put on there for the ports. One's the fill port, water fill port, and the other is the hydrogen out port. The ports are wider, and there's no chance for rust on that. On the top is also the plus and minus electrodes that go through the top. It's connected on the bottom of that lid to the plates. This is a view of the gold plated fill center. There's two of them. You're looking at only one. And that's one of the electrodes. The 3L will be finished in about a day and a half. And the finished pictures will be on hydrogentap.com along with the video of the installation on the YouTube.